I need to head way down. Aiden, where are you? I'm near the dam. Meet me, and then we'll go to the observatory. That's the place you're looking for. But the observatory's soaked in chemicals. Find me in the two-story building squeezed between the dam and the promenade. The promenade? I need to head down. Oh, Aiden, don't let me die. There we go. I'm all good. Is there anything in here? There ain't nothing. Oh. Hi. It's you. Had a feeling we'd cross paths sooner or later. You patched up Barney, right? He whimpered like a baby as soon as he saw the needle. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE database. What do you want from it, Aiden? Why are you risking so much? I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there, had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? Why are you helping me? Are you looking for something in the database as well? Aiden, those vaults contain my organization's biggest secrets. I almost died because I was a part of it. I need to know what they were hiding. What if you don't like what you discover? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. How did a GRE doctor wind up at the bazaar? By not letting anyone know I was a GRE doctor. After the revolution, the GRE were blamed for the disaster. Personnel were rounded up and... executed. People used revenge to relieve the pain. Doesn't matter if it doesn't work. What happened, happened. Now I'm someone else. How are you planning to get us inside the observatory? Look, there's a security tunnel into the complex. It was locked up years ago. Give me the key, Aiden. Kai's surprised he went, didn't go away. Are like... you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Is there any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay. Then come with me. I have something to show you. I'm kind of surprised Aiden just handed it over. Not gonna lie. Not for sure. Oh, hey. I thought for sure he'd be like, hold up, let me, let me do it. Like, install the key himself or... <laughs> Something. See those domes? Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. The THV what? The chemicals. They came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. Oh, those must be worth a pretty penny. 
They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one for you. Wait, you're not coming? No, I, I will join you, but first, I'd like you to restore the power to the building. You see, I have panic attacks when I'm in tight spaces or in the dark. <laughs> now you probably think I'm a coward. Not at all. I think it took guts to come here. So let's do this. When you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome, and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There. You'll be safe. Then head to the B block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go. The blocker is working. Yo, <sighs> dope. The blocker is working. Okay. Oh, but there's so many of these rocks. Oh, it's only a white one. But there's another one. Maybe. <laughs> Actually, don't know. Like. Okay. Uh, door, door, door. Okay. Warning, main power circuit malfunction in block B. Emergency protocol initiated. Veronica, I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. Where do I go? Oh. Ooh. Anything else up here? I think that's it. Oh, but somebody's been in here. Hey, Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. But how do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once, long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. Really. <laughs> that's understandable. You don't like to remember things, but if you have such a good memory, you kind of have to. Veronica, I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. Well, it isn't. I don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden. Okay. I need to put it on. I don't know which way I'm going. I'm going down. It's not and just do that. What is that? Ah. 
That doesn't seem great. Veronica, I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security panel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. Yeah, this place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. Hey. Aiden? What? What's going on? The elevator! It stopped! I see. I think it blew a fuse. I'm checking. Do something. Quick. Please. Don't worry. I'll fix it. Please. Don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, before she starts panicking, let's get going. I don't know how I would restore the power. Fuck! Aiden! Do oh. something! Let me out! Oh my god. I'm working on it. Let me out! Let me out! I'm not sitting on my hands here, Veronica. Oh, damn it. This Try game, to too? <sighs> okay. Is it really going to, like, nah, let me play the game. My internet restarted. I apologize. I'll be back when it's up. Okay. We are back. And... I would believe, I'm assuming. Yeah, okay. I just gotta make this run Veronica, again. I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. Is this all. No, okay. So, my game reset a little bit. Not to worry, though. Ow. Well, it isn't. Don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden. Okay. Here we go, once again. <laughs> Apparently... I didn't know this, you just had to hold it. I thought for sure you had to like tap it. Maybe that first tap like explodes it or something? Like sends a big light and then focuses. The electricity's on. Great. The security panel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. Yeah, this place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. Aiden? What? What's going on? The elevator! It stopped! I see. I think it blew a fuse. I'm checking. All right, I don't want her screaming in my ear. I'll fix it. Please, don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Oh, okay. There we go. Fuck! Aiden! Do something! Veronica, the power's 
Jack's back. You all right? Well, that's still shocking. Veronica, I'll meet you by the elevators. I'm scared to go in this water. Oh, I'm good. Cool. I wanted to, like, re get everything in here. Yeah, meet you by the elevators. Please stop screaming in my ear. Anybody else? Oh, there's actually a bunch of stuff in here. <laughs> I'm gonna have to make so much... Ooh, antibiotics? Gonna have to make a whole lot of... What's, what's even the point of these? I don't know. I really didn't get to look in this area since I couldn't stop running. Well, I'll start making a lot of lockpicks here in a second. So hopefully a bunch of this area is scrap. So that's not bad. going to assume stuff past here is alive? Yeah. Maybe I can buy a bunch of scrap. If so, that would be really nice. I like how the elevator comes down at my pace, not her pace. Are you all right? See? Told you everything would work out. Just get in. I apologize, but I had to take my time. You always been claustrophobic? Seriously? For over 10 years. So what happened then? Aiden, for God's sake, can we not talk about this right now? The, the database, where is it? Just give me a moment. <laughs> don't want to talk about it. You don't want me to just Hello. ask. Even farther than this? Another six floors down. This is a pretty high tech. Before the GRE, this complex was run by the military. They used it to monitor threats, rocket attacks, that sort of thing. That's why they called it the observatory. Then the virus came, and that was the end. So what happened here, in the end? Well, the GRE lost control of the situation, and it all went to hell. Everything collapsed. From what I know, the scientists at first barricaded themselves inside. But soon, conditions in here were as bad as they were in the city. So some of them quietly slipped out. And those who stayed 
are the ones you got rid of earlier. So the military ran this place before the GRE? Yes. It used to be a Cold War command bunker. Cold War? A period in the last century. Wars back then were fought on a grander scale. It wasn't just about day-to-day -day matters like having enough water, UV lamps, and food scraps. In a way, though, it was just like things are now. People lived every day in constant fear. That's quite the story. They used to call places like this witnesses to history. Great. Dark again. Wait. I'll try and figure something out. <laughs> At least we're not in like a if small We have electricity room. here. We could use it to power up the whole floor. Oh, I hope so. Because I really don't want her screaming in my ear again. I'm not saying anything like claustrophobia is bad. I understand. I hope nobody ever has it. <laughs> okay. Oh, hey. Can I go up and over? Or... Oh, that's what it looks like. <laughs> 